Say hi. He's loving that thing. <laughs> He's showing off. <laughs> stay back, dude. It'll stay back way back. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty good. Interesting ride. I thought it was right. It's getting a lot of speed now. Can't stop it. Oh, man. He looks like a big orange scorpion. I think. What are we gonna do with this guy? He's out of control, man. That's all I gotta tell you. This guy is out of control. Stay there. Here he comes again. Watch your gun to dad, be careful. We're not sure what he's gonna do. He can fly through here like an animal. Definitely didn't expect it to do that. Pretty sure I could have just laid patch for, for like a hundred feet if I didn't laid on it. <laughs> so initial impressions after our little uh, Hoonigan fun up and down the street after getting this thing home. Uh, it's awesome. It's a lot of fun. It's absolutely nothing like a motorcycle, which I'm sure anybody who's ever read anything about this knows they've heard that a thousand times. It's not. It's nothing like a motorcycle. but. I can tell you that in just the, the half hour ride home from where we picked it up, I basically had to learn how to ride it. Um, one thing I can tell you straight off the bat is don't grab the handlebars too tight. If you grab the handlebars too tight, you start putting too much input into the steering and it, it gets very sensitive. You want to just sit on the thing and just be stable on it, just you know, be light with your input onto the bars. It does take it does take a little bit of riding here to get used to, to how it handles and stuff. Um, otherwise, you know, you will feel awkward on it when you first get on it and stuff. So it takes a little while getting used to it. But as you can see, we got used to it really fast. We're already, you know, uh, having a hell of a time with it. Now, I'm going to dive more into it. And we'll, we'll, we'll get more uh, fun videos up on this thing uh, real soon as I uh, find out more about the handling characteristics of brakes. Brakes are awesome, by the way. All right, good deal. It's like a space age. 
we have it's been like having, an Epcot bike. We have been having a ball. Okay, why are we? It's like insane. It's so much fun. It's ridiculous. Okay, it looks fun. You Isn't should see the video. Like I laid packs for like ten feet. <laughs> why is she crying? <laughs> Alright, so Erin's initial impressions were she's usually like she'd walk up, she'd be like, eh, it's interesting, it's kind of weird, she'd be like that, but she liked it. She walked up, she was like, oh, it's cool. Yeah, yeah. So that, that's cool, that's a good sign. I haven't gotten her on it yet, maybe in like a minute or two we'll get her on it and then we'll see what goes on. Wait till we take it to a parking lot. Can't do it in the neighborhood here, but I want to see how 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 out of whack I can get this thing. I know this thing's going to be on wrong wheels. It's not like really, uh, I'm going to switch hands because the wind out here is killing us. Um, it's supposed to be like a rolling computer on wheels as far as how it's safe. It won't let you flip it and all that. But I, I know I've seen videos where guys can get these things, you know, to break loose a little bit. I want to see how well we can do that. Like it would be fun trying to get dangerous. 